good evening and it's time for my second part of my Last Remnant 2 play, um, uh, Last Remnant Remastered play, part 2. Uh, not going to be as uh, long as I was yesterday in this play, but should hopefully get some stuff done. There we go. Now, if I remember rightly, I had um, just completed. Oh, what's it called? Still on my first visit to the Dilmore Plains. Having come back from there, I um, got access to the Union of the Golden Chalice, uh, where I um, then did another couple of little side missions and unlocked access to Balls. And unfortunately, can't afford to hire him yet. So let's go sell a little bit of. Uh, junk and captured critters. Anyway, I will do really. Uh, where are we? There we are. I always like to keep at least one sample of each creature. Ooh, wow. Didn't realise they were so valuable. Didn't realise I got two of them. <laughs> yeah, so there we go. Now, is that more for right there? Two thousand two hundred higher balsam, so let's go do that now. He's of course a bit of a beast. He's tanky and powerful. So If this is anything like the last time I played, it'll probably be um, it'll probably end up being a staple in my team. Oh, 2,800. Sorry. Still, we've got plenty. Bit of change. This tells you what items they'll be looking for to upgrade the weapon, um, which is useful. Always useful that they've got their um, restorative herbs. Barson has joined the party. Excellent. Did not mean to press that one, but it gets us out of there a little bit quicker. Right. Battle units, three out of three. Mm, unfortunately, that's all I can have at the minute, so I'm going to need to drop either Oaks or McGrady for Balsam. Unfortunately, it'll probably be Oaks because McGrady is kind of the healer of the group. So, let's just modify this. Confirm units, there we go. Impressive, huh? Nope. No one. Is 
stick with the arrow of Athlum for now. Swap rush for Balsam, because he works better in the top slot. Um, rush up front. Like I said, look at the um, stats um, change. All positive increases, so... Still on the Arrow of Athlum 2, but I don't remember how. I don't remember the nuances of getting um, the different varieties. Uh, that's that, I think. A little bit of grinding, maybe in order. Uh, let's chat with this dude. Check out the pub. Yeah, just, we'll come back to the pub in a bit. Let's go through. Um, <coughs> let's clear Dilmore once, because there's a l couple of bits of loot that um, were missed on that last visit because of cutscenes and what have you. And um, we're going to have to be somewhat more cautious this time as well because taking on all three of those in a single combat at this now, that'll just be quite lethal. So let's, to me, not them. Let's do this! So let's start here. Certainly, I do hope to for the future at least stream entire experience with replaying this game. Hopefully, be ordered points where I've uh, made it to in the past. Uh, if not beyond, then. Uh, well, let's cross that bridge when we come to it, but I do hope to keep co continuing to stream as I play. Maybe a couple of times when I um, just have a little bit of a grinding session off out of stream, but I'll not do anything uh, to move forwards. Anyway, um, what am I working on today? Let's play it by ear. What are you looking at? You okay? Excellent. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Slamming with combat this time. It's... Wow, McGrady's a um, slippery looking swap. This split up a little bit. Now, the good thing about the time shift is when they've split up a little bit, that's a pain to siphon one or two off. When they've split up a little bit with the time shift, you can kind of just ease in until you've only got. Come on, come at me. Come on, just, just you, just, just swing around and Let's do this. he's just that one in to a fight. Yeah, more risk, more reward, but like I said, having only one union, and at the minute, it, it's genuinely pretty squishy. It's not going to hold up too well <laughs> against five. Of these, I mean, it's doable, just, but not very comfortably. It's, I'm not risking it, is what I'm saying. Uh, 
these things. Either that or Rook is just too powerful. Yeah, let's kick some tail. Nah, let's just Oh, dodgy little swats. Are you saying you want me to be triggered? Uh, oh, no capture. Siphon them off, murder them group by group. The winner's the one who strikes first, yeah? Usually, dude, yeah. Um, play it by ear. I've had some good results in the past with hitting play it by ear. Excuse me, first, yeah. Ooh. Ooh, very nice. Uh, two combat arts. In a while, I may end up migrating, um, having hit combat arts and union dead to every character can eventually learn everything pretty much if you grind it. Just live different degree power, but. I like to keep you, um, balls and just focusing on what the good are, the brutes that they are. <laughs> what are you looking at? Again, right by ears. Oh! It works out well. I've seen a lot of. In the past I've seen um, hitting uh, play by ear cause some good um, reassesses. Which is when they change the their planned action. Right. Excuse me a moment. Yeah, they um Take this one. We'll throw ourselves a bit of a risk and go at the 
other two together. It'd be a very tough fight, but we should be able to do it. Let's just hit this one with the sticks. The problem is that they're just so fast. Yep, this is a risk, but let's see how it works. Oh, that works in our favour. I um, expected to be facing at least three unions, but... Ooh. Go on, man. There you go. Ah. Oh well. Missed from now and again. Just wish they were yeah. in like top of the initiative order. Nice oh, or I will capture one. Nice. You can tell when you've captured one just in the animation because if you haven't captured them, they fizzle away. If you've captured them, like this one here our new friend, it stays on the field. Oh, oh. Now there's a fight. Uh, saving again. Yeah, uh... The spawns on your maps aren't always the same. Sometimes, on rare occasions, you'll get uh, <laughs> a rare spawn, which is sat just over there. Now, those are pretty high-level beasts. I'm going to give it one attempt, and I guarantee three butts will be handed to me. What are you looking at? Oh, come on, man. Smack him in the face. Oh, all up the butt, either way. Sweet! Like, the more, you, the more unique characters and... Yeah, let's go. Let's this. do this. Just... The winner's the one who strikes first, yeah? This is going to be an interesting What are you looking at? One. Um You okay? How do you like that? Oh. Pants. Ooh, we've got to capture if we survive this. A big if. <laughs> Fortunately, we got rid of the um, group of three straight away. Right, when it comes to flanks, yeah, you get two okay. flanks, so you get... You'll be flanked twice, and then there'll be a rear attack, and then if there's a happens to be a fifth Union pile in, you will be massive attacked, and that's usually lethal. <laughs> you okay? Hang in there, all right. Ah! I was not paying attention there. You're up. Stand 
So fortunately we've got a healer in the party, so... Need to... Nothing fancy there, just don't let them take a step further, boys. Very nice. Now, like I said, that was a reassess on McGrady's part. He um, decided it'd be better to switch to a decent physical attack than just going for a basic attack. I don't need to keep my HP up anymore because. Ah, let's go for it. Too. I didn't see that. You can only carry a hundred of each material, so after a point it gets it gets to where you're gonna end up selling a lot of them, especially if you spend a while grinding. It's been times where I've been like, hmm, what am I about to go and grind? And just sold everything. Anyway, let's save this again real quick, and then um, go get uh, go pay a visit to the backside buffet. You get saved by like some dudes on Butler Island or something. Let's do this! Yay for wyverns! Is I think what the this boss enemy is. First, yeah? Oh, it's a long beak. Yeah, we're gonna get annihilated, I promise you. Combat arts, I think Balsam's my powerhouse at the minute, so what are you looking at? Oh, yeah, yeah, we're dead. Oh, oh, we got lucky. The area of effects abilities by Acid Breath actually is. Deal damage based on the actual individual units they hit, not the unions as a whole. Like that one only hit McBrady. If it hit all three, that'd have been very painful. Like Corpic Blast, if it only hits one member of an enemy union, or a friendly union if it's been used against me. It won't a deal of damage, but if you get three, five units from the Union in that blast, they're hurting. Right. There we go, and... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Exactly what I expected to see. KO. A union's HP is the sum of each member's HP. Instead of worrying about the HP of individual units, watch that of the union. Instead, union's HP falls to zero, then the whole union is incapacitated and will be unable to act. 
my entire union was rendered able to act from a single attack. I saw it coming. Now, let's just load back in and avoid that like the pain in the ass that it is. <laughs> But yeah, um, before I even spotted that I was wondering about if I'd get a respawn on this visit to the map. It's not the one I was expecting, but I'm glad it's that one which is easily avoidable. Uh, the other one has one of the birds that I was um, whinging about yesterday smack dab in the middle of this bridge which is a lot more difficult to Let's avoid. The one who strikes first, yeah? What are you looking at? Ooh. Oh, come on! How would you like that? <sighs> I need to be paying more attention. <laughs> That's what I like to see. All three attacking with a combat arc. Just dive in. It, won't, it definitely won't require all three, but. Thought they'd be made of sterner stuff. I know I'm good. Nice. I also don't like it when this bridge is empty. There's nothing bad about the bridge being empty as such. It's only empty because of that because there is a rare spawn on the map and it's sat over there. But ready? Uh, no, that's not it. I'm not going to save yet. Save yet. He's one of these in. Ah, uh, two will do. As long as I didn't um, bag the off the three. The winner's the one who strikes first, yeah? <laughs> Ass indeed. What are you looking at? You okay? Yeah, let's kick some tail. Still a mystic. It's been a while since I've had Rush yeah. Mystic. There we go. That was a close one. I know I'm good. Now I always like it when I see HP grow growth because that means it's let's do this. The HP to that particular, for that individual unit has grown, but it also means. But that obviously also directly contributes to the HP of the union that they're in. So what are you looking at? It's always nice to see because it just means that we can our durability and capacity to survive increases. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Eh, uh, play this one by you. Oh! There we go. I know I'm good. 
AP is your action points. It kind of works as a cross between your what in other games would be your mana and your stamina. Um, I'll explain it a little bit more when we get into this next combat because it's never overtly explained. Oh. Not without the use of an instruction manual or a guidebook. Though it's not that difficult to understand. Now we'll go through this. Right, in the bottom corner you can see that, um, in the bottom right corner is my, uh, the one union that I've got at the minute. You can see it's total HP, which it starts a fight with, and then it's got its AP, which is plus 18 stroke 79. 79 is the maximum and 18 is the growth per turn. Um, it's also how much you start with on your first turn. You don't start with your maximum AP, which means you can't just stroll into a fight and unleash a clusterfuck barrage of your most powerful abilities in Let's two seconds this. flat. Now, my commands here each um, have an AP cost um, listed off, and if I switch to the unit status, you can see that the Mystic Arts, the only Mystic Art that I've got there is Rush's Spark 4, which just that attack on its own must cost 8 AP. Now, Balson and McGrady, um, both using different varieties of double strike in Ridley. That comes to a total of 14 AP. Now, when we choose one of them, let's, for the sake of argument, use the combat arts this turn. Yeah, this is going to be over in one turn, so hopefully in the next fight I'll have a better at? chance to showcase this. <laughs> Unless they like dodge, which they won't. There we go. Yeah, like I say, hopefully in the next fight I'll be able to showcase it a little more clearly. Only need two Let's do this. enemy unions in a fight to display it, but. The one who strikes first, oh, yeah? there's only one here, so just attack and get it out of the way with regular attacks. Like Alright, so, didn't use any AP there, and second turn, my AP bar in the bottom left increases by yet another 18, it's now 36. Which then allows me to use greater number of abilities and more powerful abilities, a combination thereof. Right, I have the keep your HP up option now, a total of 24 AP. Wasn't able to do that on the first turn. Um, let's take it just for the laugh. Now you can also see your AP. I know I'm good. The AP doesn't um, drop, get deducted as soon as you choose your command for the turn. It decreases as the abilities themselves are used. Now, if you if you choose something which has three abilities which use AP. It will use it as each gets used now. If you only end up using two because you defeat the enemy union, it will only deduct the AP cost of the two abilities used, not the full three. So it does work out nicely. Let's do this. The winner's 
the one who strikes first, yeah? Just being passive towards me, so there was no reason to um, do the time shift. Let's mystic this one. What are you looking at? You're through! How do you like that? I know I'm good. Now every um, individual unit in this game also has a unique characteristic to them. Balsons is hard working like Emma's which you may have seen in the last um, stream it's love. Uh, let's have a look. Let's go to party members. Yeah. Balsons is hard working, Rush's is bravery, and McGrady's is gluttony, the fat bastard. Uh, let's just save real quick. Because I'm going to um, challenge myself with this in just a moment. Let's see that. Yeah, it's just these two. So one of these is a Let's King Raps her. And uh the being a the variant, uh, first, yeah? more difficult to kill, so let's hit these hard and fast. What are you looking at? Stand your ground. And hope we um you like that? deal with them in the first. Wait. There we go, yeah. Just what I needed. Just what we need. Right. Keep our HP up, it looks like no oh, Balsam's gonna be the one that's um dishing out the herb. And then, yeah. You're up. Stand your ground. I feel like Mystic is the way to go this time. There we go. Do we get a reassess on the grid? Don't let them take nah. a step further, oh. boys. Uh, right by here. Ooh, capture. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Yeah, in some ways in this game I can be a bit of a trophy hunter. I like to keep one of each capture. Um, as I progress through the game. I don't know why. Treasure chest. She'll be here at shield. Ooh, and a superior necklace. Very nice. Let's slap that on rush straight away. And uh, that is one pass of Dilmar completed. We're leaving stronger than we were when we arrived. Uh, what is the teleport? Oh, there it is. That blends in. Right. Let's move. Back to Athlum and we'll go do what any adventurers should do after a day out. We're gonna go to the pub. Right, 
Right. The way to tell if anybody actually will progress things along is like the bartender here has the red outlined speech bubble, the rest are black. So, talk to this dude. It's a good way of knowing when a conversation will just just speaking to somebody will progress things. Alright. Let's have a look. Have I completed any guild tasks? That's a good point question. Again, always good to check in, just check in at the guild, really. Um, tasks, no, still got these in progress. Blackdale, that's... That's the um, cave network where I got... Oh, oh I... Either myself or Cassini once got uh, over a thousand on the chains, which is a thou, which means a thousand individual enemy units killed. Uh, took a while, <laughs> a good few hours, and just always praying that you don't get touched by an enemy before you have a chance to initiate the combat because as soon as that happens you lose that chain and it is disheartening once you're a couple of hundred in and it's just like and the chain's broken it's like no City map and the town square. Let's just check this soldier, which was telling me to go to the pub for information. See if he's got anything else to say to me now. What's up, dude? Done both of those things, so let's just. time since I played this because I didn't think I got access to self play so quickly. New city, new stores, new um, union guild. Uh, I say new. A different members shall we say oh. go from dual wielding the katanas to just wielding a giant one. I may do that. I 
Unfortunately, Rush is the only party member that you can actually outfit, as it were. The Ophidian Choker. Well, outfit directly, like I say, the, you can get things which your leaders will request, but sell the heater shield, I'll never use it. Let's just display the box. It looks like a radiator. So it's called a heater shield because it looks like a sodding radiator. So, what captures I can spare? That was just them. Yep, she wants to herb. It just looks broken to me, but uh, there he is. <laughs> Worst caving expedition ever. What? There he is! I think we're going to do this um, side quest that we've got coming up uh, because I've been teased and I can't leave it now. Oh! Lambero district is now accessible. I believe that's where the pub is. So let's, um, again, more adventurers. When you're in town, let's hit the pub. It's none of these, I don't think we'll have anything interesting to say, just a little bit of world, little bits of world building. Very popular with some types. The horny ones, apparently. And this is a far bigger pub than the one in Athlum. I'm not sure it's got a lot more in here at the minute, but 
Let's have a little natter around. It is a pretty long trip. Even the highborn have drama. Yeah, it's the only entertainment they have. <laughs> In any universe, it seems. Yes, the one that tells us that it's a long way to illusion from here. This fella. Alright. Leave you two for now and let's meet him. Ham. <laughs> yeah, if he really wants to, how can I say no? Look at that face. Mr. Diggs! Genuinely was gonna call it just quits after the um, run around Delmar, but then I remembered I can meet Mr. Diggs and have a bit of a run around. Mysterious thing. Mr. Diggs has joined the party. Harvesting is now available at harvest points within dungeons and other locations. The number of times Mr. Diggs can harvest is displayed as the Diggs count. Ew. This count is reset upon returning to the world map. We have five digs currently. Let's do some murdering while we're here. The winner's the one who strikes first, yeah? Yeah. Why not? Combat arts because I remember Lockjaw telling me at? that these were squishy if you punch them. You okay? As long as I don't use pin needle. Or whatever they call it. Is it pin needle? I think it is. Ah, I just missed it. Then. Ah, whoops. He's a cake. Sweet. Yep. <laughs> I 
Right, we're gonna leave this for now. I believe the harvesting the material that I need will end the mission. Let's I just in a minute I just gonna go through this place just the once and Ah, yeah, there is a, I believe there is a bit of a delay on the stream. I hope it's not too big. Um. I'm afraid I don't know how to deal with that, uh, how to adjust that latency, however, so. you like that too shabby? Get them in car. Murdered first. What are you looking at? You okay? Ah, oh, I was hoping to capture one of them, but. trouble. We're in trouble. Oh. Just break the deadlock and heal. Keep it together. Assault. When in deadlock, if one union is flank attacked by two unions, any further unions deadlocking the victim union launch a rear assault. Unions performing a rear assault deal extra damage. Apparently, they also get a free rear assault if that you get red locked. Smack them in the teeth. There we go. Just hang in there. Ooh. Oh, nice. Level up on the hit restoratives there. I do like that the level ups can come mid battle as what the ability increases can come mid battle as well. I know I'm good. Yeah you are. Ooh, devil's due too. Nice. All those enemies not single capture. It's disappointing. Back to that harvest point now that we've 
hopefully this out of what few enemies there were. And let's give Mr. Jigs something to do. It makes him so happy. Come on out! Look at him. Okay, later. Now the mission was only to acquire one art piece, and then it ends automatically. That's why I went and killed things. <laughs> yeah. A grand for that, it's... Hey, there we go, that's uh, Mr. Diggs. Some soldiers were looking for someone. Is it me? Is it? Is it? Probably. Uh. Before I indulge you, I'm just gonna go stick my head in here. See what's new, what's different. Who's single, who's taken? I don't know. Uh, what's up, dude? Uh, no, not yet. Uh, you know, I don't think I've ever, ever, ever hired a armor that uses a shield. Fine with that, and um, huh. it's damn near the hour I was looking for, so um, starts this dude, see if we get a little bit of direction for the next time we start and uh well dull faced silly outfits you ignorant jackass yes <laughs> right Dave Which castle, dude? Yeah, we'll find out when we go to the world map, I'm sure. But for now, that's that. It's been a, like I say, it's been about an hour overall, and we've got quite a bit done. We've had an explorer of Dilmar, we've had. We've met Mr. Diggs at last, and uh, his menu is adorable. Status menu. He has wee power, wee technique, and he's a wee driller. Those will all increase the more you use him. I can't wait until we get to baby power, baby technique, and baby driller. But just look at the little thing. It's the mecha hamster. Where, where did you come from? Who made you? You don't care, you just want to dig. Who can blame him? Anyway. Uh, before we leave, let's have a quick save. So we all know that I've done it. There we go, back um back to this. Not a lot's changed, but we're getting there. Um, <laughs> I 
Yeah, comments will be a memory test in the future, I'm sure. Um, anyway. That's that, my hour's up, and I really don't want to progress too much further tonight. Um, hopefully I'll be around a couple of hours tomorrow. Hopefully. So, I'll be back then. Have fun, take care, and um, catch you later. Oh, wrong button. <laughs>